Welcome to the week ahead, where we bring you key developments likely to impact Sri Lanka in the upcoming week. Headlines IMF team to arrive in Sri Lanka Public sector workers begin two-week work from home Fuel prices likely to be revised First China rice shipment to come up Island-wide inflation for May to be released On Monday, a staff-level delegation from the IMF will arrive in Sri Lanka to discuss an economic program. This follows Prime Minister Ronald Vikram Singha's discussion with the Managing Director of the IMF, Kristalina Goyogieva two weeks ago, where he requested that a delegation visit the country as soon as possible so that an agreement could be finalized. The team will be in the island until June 30. From Monday state sector workers excluding those in essential services will begin a two-week, work-from-home period. This follows a circular from the Ministry of Public Administration, citing public and private transport challenges due to fuel shortages, and adding that public sector operations should function without disruption. Fuel prices are likely to be adjusted. As per the Secretary to the Ministry of Power and Energy, prices may go up or down according to the price formula. Adding that, after reviewing several factors including global oil prices, fuel prices are revised once every two weeks or monthly. The last revision was made on 24 May. On Saturday, Sri Lanka is slated to receive the first rice shipment from China, as part of a sixth shipment. 74 million US dollars arrangement. The second consignment is anticipated on the 30th of June. Island-wide inflation figures for May are likely to be released this week, and we expect it to be another record-breaking number. May Colombo inflation was 39.1% from a year earlier. And that's a wrap for this week. Join us next time for more key developments, as we keep you informed of the week ahead.